hello friends my name is Muhammad Sabtar and today we are going to set up angular js2 with vs code editor so vs code editor is a lighter version or editor uh, developed by microsoft so we are going to set up angular js2 template by using that so previously we have seen how to set up angular js2 template with Visual Studio 2015. Now we are going to set up Angular JS2 template with VS Code Editor. So quickly move to the prerequisite required for that. So basically, you you have to install a Node.js on your system. So I have given a link of uh, from where you can download a Node.js. So here you can download a Node.js on your systems. And uh, second thing required. VS Code Editor. So, we I have also given the link uh, in a description section. So, download according to your uh, platform, according to your OS, and install on your machine. And after that, yeah. So, I just wanted you to go to the Angular JS two documentation so just go to the angular js2 documentation website so you can see you can see there is a lot of documentation given let's do angular js2 so you can quickly learn or adopt the new changes present in angular js2 so i just wanted to highlight one thing here when you go to the uh, angular js2 uh, website you can say that there is setup for local development so we are going to set up a, a template which will be present on our local machine so here you can yeah so on first you can see there is a quick start guide is given to us so what types what are the basic components present in our template it's, it gives a nice description about that but we are actually not going to see into uh, much detail of that so we are going directly going to the quick start seed project so basically angular just to provide a, there is a seed project which contains all required file for us so that can be downloaded into our local machines and we can uh, start uh, building application based on that so I just click on the quick start seed project. So please go down below. Down, down. There is a link. Yeah, here. There is a link to download a seed project. So click on that link. Yeah, here is a zip files. You can download a, a quick start or seed project on your local machine. Yeah, there it is downloaded. So just navigate to that. Uh, downloaded file i have downloaded that file here in my location and i have unzipped that file so you can see there is a lot too many files present in that after unzip so we have completed uh, our uh, first major step as given in a powerpoint now we have to start node.js so basically node.js required uh, to install the dependencies present in our C project so just go to your start menu node type node and here is a node.js command prompt now navigate to your folder where we have unzipped the C project so in my case it's cd desktop sorry cd Master, yeah. So yeah, yeah, here you can see all the files we have unzipped here are present. So I just type npm install. So basically, it will install all the required dependencies into our application. Uh, initially, it will take some times, depend our depend on your internet connection. But yeah. So I have already installed all the required dependencies so it is much faster completed much faster in my machine so nothing happens I think 
it's already succeeded already installed all the required dependencies so if you are doing this first time so you can see that after uh, npm install there is a after successful installation there is a tree type of structure you can see in a yellow section after that you have to uh, start your downloaded template so just type npm install and hit enter so basically it will uh, start a browser light server is started and which it will open our browser and uh, our initial page will be displayed it will take it will take some time yeah here so to yeah here whoa so actually it's loaded you can see there is here angular is present so it is present in our application which we have present in our seed project which we have downloaded so basically started so let's have a look open vs code editor so actually we have started but we have not made any changes into it so just why close window close editor close window After that you have to open the VS code now navigate to your seed project I have just selected this project initially it will take some time yeah here so you can see that we have these main types of files present just go to app component.js Let's go to component.ts there is hello name so what is the name angular so just change to angular to save these files it, it will automatically reflect it in a browser wait for some times here it will detect the changes yes and yeah here it is hello angular js2 so we have successfully uh, implemented the seed project in our local environment and apart from that I just wanted to confirm that uh, please uh, after downloading the visual studio code editor just install some of the basic extension like we I have, done, uh, I have added the auto closing tag HTML class suggestion and HTML class completion so basically it's required when we are developing some of the softwares related to the bootstrap classes are there so it will suggest the names of the classes present in our CSS file and auto closing it's required to auto close some of the tags uh, tags we are using HTML tags we are using in our template so basically we have set up our initial angularjs2 seed project with vs code editor so i have given a link into a description so please follow those uh, links and download the prerequisite softwares So after successfully you can see there is a hello angular will be shown in the in a ui so thanks for watching please subscribe share your comments uh, and yeah please subscribe to my channel and uh, post your comments suggestions and what other topics you would like to hear and in next uh, topics we are going to show you some of the fundamentals of angular js2 what are the components how we are going to use the components what are modules what are forms this type of modules we are going to cover in our next topic so hope you like the lecture thank you thank you very much